Hi guys, this is ML and we are back playing U4 as Mamluks. Now, I looked through all the options that we have and uh, it seems I missed uh, one opportunity that we had, which is what we would call a timing attack against uh, the Ottomans. So, uh, we could have, mm, before we dumped our spur military points uh, into those two provinces, uh, we could have uh, basically have taken uh, a golden age and uh, to get minus 10% all power costs and then we could have uh, simply taken uh, military technology 6 for paying uh, just under 1000 for it and uh, by using that we could have uh, attacked ottomans uh, right now it's not uh, the most important tech because it basically introduces guns that are not going to be all that useful quite yet, so that's not important, but it uh, gives a little bit of military tactics which would uh, make us uh, take less damage in combat as well as uh, siege uh, forts a bit faster. So it, it was an opportunity, but it seems that uh, AI uh, Ottomans are uh, playing a bit silly and for some reason most of their forces are trap in Cyprus while they are at war, I uh, remind you so. And that would be a bit of an ex exploit. It seems that some of the uh, uh, cogs are coming to grab them, but uh, if you take a look at the map of their forts, uh, well, uh, as you can see here, we have uh, uh, just a quick stroll to all of the forts in Anatolia. Since we can go through a Karaman here and uh, just start besieging Sugla, and Kara is, you know, uh, right here, and so we can just walk to Sinop and, uh, and trap them. So uh, it's, it would be a pr possibly uh, quite a good blitzkrieg, all things considered. So it it was a possibility. Now, uh, what we are going to do, however, is we are going to wait for. Uh, for this whole mess to to finish, basically, and I don't think we are going to uh, to, to start. Uh, I don't think we are going to attack Ethiopia quite yet. I don't want to spend too many admin points because, well, uh, even in, while we are getting a lot of them, uh, we need to finish uh, the the idea group and uh, get all that. Uh, you know, states and religions and cultures uh, sorted out. So, um, once we annex Medina, uh, we are going to uh, basically get uh, go for that war against Adal and Yemen or Aden, uh, whoever uh, is left standing here, and uh, basically grab a little bit of land uh, as well as those two center of centers of trade. And that that should be enough for now, I think. Now we're still waiting for this this core to finish before we uh, go on and start, uh, you know, uh, and st start converting because well this is not all that great with hundreds uh, hundred months for it. So let's uh, we could do the drilling and. Uh, Okay, uh, having been educated to be loyal warriors, uh, early years of studies often have a well, lack of trust with... Yeah, what is it? Um, commander from Alvit Anas, local manpower and local defensiveness, or local unrest and local defensiveness. Um, Well, we don't really care either way. Uh, so let's just get just messy. Growth of business. Okay, base production in Halab. That's nice. And Ramazan. I uh, got that. Alright. King good. Hmm. Nicely developed province there. Yeah, okay, they, they, uh, they are moving their, their units, so that's alright. Um, oh, right, I forgot. Uh, okay, let's uh, uh, remove that uh, as a state, I guess, well. 
kind of, kind of have to, and we're going to remove that as well. Oh, actually, let's remove this one first. Uh, I believe at least yes, this province is by Amis. I need to remove that and sing this for this one. Uh, the loyalty will drop, but well, what can you do? Mm. And this is going to be a territory now. Yeah. Uh, what I was wondering if uh, yeah, I wanted to do it now because I, I was wondering if that's a percent of uh, development in the states or percent of overall development. It hasn't changed, but maybe we'll give it a second to tick. Uh, doesn't seem of state development still. Okay, let's. Uh, we won't be able to, to remove that without really messing uh, with uh, with Amir's here. So let's see. Yeah, two provinces. That would cost us 0.8. Uh, let's take a look. Pepper, uh, can we? We could call diet, and I think that's that's the way to go here. Uh, we'll play some prestige, and we'll be dangerously high. Uh, in regards to you know uh, influence, but I think we can handle that. So let's uh, let's just remove all that and that's fixed. There we go. Mm. And that's not on your state. There we go. And okay, and that actually fixed it. So that's a state development. Uh, so that should get back up in well. Shortly, we actually want to give someone uh, some territory. Uh, I mean, uh, give Lima some of the territories. Let's take a look. Uh -huh. Slice stuck there. Uh, this grain. Yeah, we could give them one of the uh, smaller provinces actually. Uh, let's just give this one, and that should appease them. Uh, how are we on this uh, disaster? Uh, Sixty-five percent. Yes, it's probably about time we need to do something about it. Uh, can we? So they are at forty-five percent, which is not ideal. Uh, mm -hmm. So if we were to remove this, that would. Uh, Okay, that would barely decrease the influence, but it would be a big hit to our... How about this? Influence by 2%? Ah, this is problematic. One of those, uh, I don't think it will help much. Nope. Yeah. Mm. Alright, uh... I guess the uh, fact that we increased, uh, we basically lowered the uh, amount of territory that is in the state, so actually bumped uh, that that uh, that influence up and sped up uh, the, the the disaster. Now uh, well, that's okay. Let's take a look once more at uh, the states and territories now. I think we'll just make this into a state. Uh, I mean, it could be nice to develop it later, but uh, hmm. let's see. This is pretty bad, Lower Nubia, and we still need how long uh, for this core to finish? Hmm. A year. Oh. But we would be. Uh, dangerously close to to, um, to the disaster firing. Uh -huh -huh. And this is pretty much worthless, is it? Yes, it is. Um, okay, so I think we need what we need to do is remove one of those provinces that they own, but hopefully not. Uh, the type that would, uh, what is the lowest one? This one would be the lowest. Uh, 
that would still give, uh, get them under 40% uh, and barely lowered uh, the, the influence. Okay, this is this. Uh, why uh, is it lowering their influence so little? Uh, let's see. All oh, right. Oh, of course, Halab got that event uh, that increased it so so significantly. Uh, so this would basically fix this, but it would really get us uh, annoyingly low. Mm, same goes for this. I guess we'll have to uh, remove the mask. Uh, the mask. Uh, not quite yet. Mm, annoying stuff. There's expired, Kabash and uh, QQ. You guys at war. You are, and you're actually winning. Uh, so you wouldn't be able to uh, to fight you anyway. We are getting... Uh, right, let's see the claim. Visa, okay. So we can indeed get claims behind our uh, claims. Well, the thing is that we don't really need the uh, claims here anyway, because we will be giving that to Hajj, so we just need one. Uh, problem is that uh, this war ended, and hmm, uh, sadly we won't be able to get uh, Yemen in one go. Mm, those are cores though, so. Huh. What we could actually do is basically, um, well, get Yemen as our uh, vassal and then get her uh, get her conquest. Mm, that being said, they're allied with those guys, which is a bit annoying. Uh, mm -hmm, mm. Okay, that's problematic. Uh, this war is still going. Hmm. Okay, let's wait for this one to uh, to finish. And while we, uh, this is all right. We are annexing, and we are working on Ethiopia. I guess we can get one more in it, on Ethiopia. We can make states. I know. Hmm. Mm -hmm -hmm. Okay, I guess we will just remove that. Uh, damn it, I really hate it. Uh, that's thirty percent hit to our uh, to our trade efficiency. So that will butcher our uh, our trade income. Mm -hmm. There's nothing we can do though. Oh well, I've put myself in this in this position anyway, so no point uh, complaining. Let's see what it fires once again in July. So we could ah, uh, this is dangerous. Okay, well, no no way around it. I'm afraid. We could slow it down, I guess, but okay. Uh, 30 bloody one. Uh, that's what. That's a long time. Uh, let's see how that is going to look. Uh, we lost like uh, three decades. Uh, I guess we can afford this right now. Now, okay, so what about the wars? Let's uh, start. Expand it now. One of our goals should probably be uh, getting strong enough so we can uh, offer a vassalization to Karaman. Um, we are much closer that we, than we were earlier, but not quite yet. Not quite there yet, so let's see. Basically, uh, I believe that's just our development, not uh, our actual income, because that's 
it was 71 uh, last time I checked between the episodes. So. Uh, oh no, not this one again. Damn it. Did we either get 15 years of uh, national tax modifier hit or get a stability hit? Uh, how much are we through? Okay, let's get tax modifier hit. I need that stability for, for all the... Uh, for all the conversions we are planning. Uh, let's wait. We need that admin tag to, to get the course on our... Mm -hmm. <laughs> Alright, so that would be uh, on this one. Alright. Medina is halfway through. Alright. Come on, finish this bloody war. I want to see where the chips fall. Uh, all in all, we should. will be. Uh, let's see. Offer vassalization. Uh, there are a few. Okay, so Yemen would actually accept the, the, just I uh, accept the devastation outright. Uh, we could actually uh, vassalize them right now or soon-ish, and then get uh, basically feed uh, Aiden to uh, to them. And just the easiest war ever. Uh, yeah, that's, uh, I like it. Okay, uh, how, oh, they actually like us, so, okay, let's uh, get let's get a claim on the capital, I guess. Uh, hmm. that, that kind of makes Hajj uh, pointless, but I guess we can feed them that uh, in the next war and start annexing them soon enough. Alright, so um, let's see Armus uh, offer vaccination. Well, we have to far off on them to do anything, but hmm. who are you allied to? Aiden? Okay, so. Oh, Aiden. Okay, so yes. Okay, that, that works. What we can do is offer vaccination to Yemen, uh, get. Uh, go to war against Aiden, and. Uh, oh, actually, you are in the allies. Well, so that it will be two wars. So we'll feed uh, uh, all the Yemeni cores to Yemen. And I guess a little bit more around here, although we uh, that would have to be another war. Okay, so in those two wars, uh, we can get uh, we can get the doll. Oh, well, a lot of it, basically. Uh, we'll have to do it uh, all in the same, at the same time, but yeah. Okay, so improve relations with them. We, need, we only need to improve by uh, 50 and then, uh, well, uh, 65 actually. Then we can simply get a marriage, get alliance and so they accept vassalization. So we'll just uh, do the whole uh, alliances later because uh, that would drain our dip dip power and we are already hurting in that regard. Yeah, but it finally comes, all comes together. If you haven't like get all that from my drivel, I will get soon enough. Uh, Alright, Upper Nubia uh, is becoming a state now. Uh, we need to core all the provinces. And uh, now let's see. Uh, at least, okay, so we need at least 20 development in the states with that culture. Mm, okay, so that's not gonna be enough, but we just we can just put two developments somewhere. Let's see. Guess we could just pump, pump two development points here and call it a day. What increases that? Uh, Burgess. All ah, right, Burgess hate us. That's that's a problem. Uh, of course, it would be nice if we could give that to Burgess, but that would uh, get us uh, all the way back into the disaster. Although uh, not that much. Well, we'll see. Uh, once we get Medina, uh, 
the, we could we should be able to basically give the burgers a little bit more uh, and still stay un, uh, under 80. Uh, for now, let's uh, allow this, this whole disaster to tick down because that doesn't disappear. It will tick down for what, 80 months now. However, it is 62 months. Um, no. What we can do is uh, now we can either give that to Demi, or we can give that to. Uh, okay, we are going to give the bits that are uh, have ranged zeal to Demi. I think. Oh, well, that barely improved the loyalty, but so, oh well. And I believe which one was it? This one has ranged zeal, so. Oh, this is actually Shia, so, uh, sadly. Mm, this is Sunni, so that's not a problem. Mm -hmm -hmm. Oh, still, let's give that to them, because uh, if, we, if we make them like us, well, for, uh, now we just have tolerance to Edens, but as you, can, as you can see, it is... Uh, 5% uh, tech cost uh, if they like us, and I'm not sure if that actually increases uh, or if once the influence gets higher. I haven't really played the uh, Muslim nation uh, since the introduction of that, I think. I guess I, I played Tunis, but I wasn't like... Well, I don't remember, either way. Uh, now uh, to do that, well, there are, there's a way we could lower the lower the taxes, which would increase their their autonomy a little bit. But that's not an issue. The problem is that to do that, we need to, uh, them to have 14 influence, which is uh, a tall order. Uh, not sure if we will be able to. There's not not really a way to get the influence any higher before we get it to. Uh, to at least 40, which is no well, problem. Yeah, everything, uh, all of those actions, and some of them are pretty damn bad, but still, uh, all the of them require uh, 40%. And I don't think there is enough of infidel land to go to go around uh, to deal with that. Uh, well. Now everyone is more or less happy, so let's leave it as it is, and... Uh, hmm. So, uh, if we made uh, clerics happy, uh, well, if they would uh, have loyalty of 60, that would give us another 2% of missionary strength, but I guess that ain't gonna happen, so... Well, I guess we can start converting this anyway. Uh, let's see, uh, oh, same time, I guess we can give the rest of what we can to Demi. Uh, oh, this is a different state, so not much uh, came out of it, of this. This could actually go to Amir, since we have it. All in all, we do need to uh, increase uh, the... Um, Uh, the development here by two, uh, and I guess this is cheapest anyway, so might as well. Mirish influx, um, devastation, dryland, arid. Yeah. Okay, we'll just pop it twice and call it a day. And now we can get Nubian culture accepted. Ah, oh, damn it! We could have bloody taken that. Uh, ah, that's. Quite a few points we wasted now. My bad. Uh, so, as you can see, nobody has accepted, so that should help a little bit with conversions. Alright, but if we convert it, the demi will disappear. Well, uh, we won't be able to uh, take advantage of that anyway, so let's just fix our regis unity, I guess. Alright. Improving relations there, very nice. Um, yeah, I guess let's keep taking. Hmm. Actually, let's wait. 
I'll take it all. Uh, at once, maybe? No, it's seven years ahead, so probably not. Uh, Influence Nation of Ramazan, yeah, they, they will be trying to uh, vassalize them shortly. They will probably succeed. You guys are still at war. Oh, you are at war with Ethiopia now. Okay, that actually makes it a bit problematic as far as going after them goes. And uh, there will be all the uh, crisscross uh, occupation. But yeah, we'll, I think we'll stick with the, the Yemen plan. Bronze cannons. Okay. Copper uh, price changes by 50%. The changes, I mean, increases. Okay, let's get into positions. Um, all right, this guy died. Uh, let's see. Uh, did I have a good one? Uh, how are we on army tradition? 33 and so on. Going down sharply, so let's I guess, get one more. Okay, this, this guy just gets a kick out, right? So does this guy. Jesus, really? Yeah, okay, this one is serviceable. Alright, let's keep it this way. I will have too, too much military power anyway, and well, I guess I'm just spamming professionalism. Uh, that's not something I would do in the previous uh, uh, previous version of the game, but now it kind of makes sense. It's a long-term investment, if you will. Um, okay, so who are we going against? Uh, okay, you are you are at war with Ethiopia, so I guess we could go against Ethiopia. If we really. After all, because uh, they have no, no allies here. Okay, and Aden actually, uh, so, and Yemen is not at uh, war with anyone. If we go against you. Yeah, but uh, first, but what? Well, uh, we won't be able to go to war before uh, if, uh, well, and, uh, we won't be able to uh, peacefully vassalize them before we. Uh, uh, if we are at war, so we need to wait for that. Okay, can still announce that's as variables, that's right. Oh, that's annoying. Although I guess this province is kind of pointless anyway, so let's just get that into autonomy. Mm -hmm. Come on. Uh, state maintenance, okay, that's nice. That basically, uh, let's see what is our state maintenance. Uh, five, okay, so that's like point, point one ducat. Now, since we have some cash, uh, how are we on? Okay, we have two more to get. And what we could do is get a few more. Uh, a few more units, because I believe we are under the limits, yeah, that will do it. At 91, we need to be at uh, 115. And we should be able to get uh, that claim next month. Hmm, okay, that's problematic. But if we go to war against both at the same... Okay, yeah, that makes sense. We'll go to war against both at the same time. That's brilliant. And here we can get a claim for Zayla, which is the one we actually want. 
Haven't I mentioned that we want to slow down with the expansion? Should have sworn I said something like that. From Ethiopia, we'll just get like two provinces, just you know, for the for the sake of it. Though now, when I think about it, we do have a lot of uh, admin power, and I think more than we need, uh, honestly. Even considering the fact that we are, uh, which probably. Uh, Promote the advisors here yeah, a little bit to get, get a few more points. I guess promoting this guy is kind of pointless. He's uh, 59, but this one? Uh, that would cost us what? Uh, to increase our cost by 3? Uh, uh, not quite. Let's actually take a look at buildings. Uh, marketplaces is the uh, place where we want to put one. Yeah, that's a bit low my liking and is this owned by yeah well it would make more sense well actually we can afford it so might as well uh, our uh, our guy is uh, by our guy I mean, our sultan is uh, has uh, bonuses that uh, make it cheaper so makes sense uh, well mm, we'll do that in Okay, I guess we can. For now, it's, I'm not sure if that's a, a good idea. Oh, I wasn't supposed to do it at home. Ah, let's do it. Alright. Mm. Relaxing that. Uh, okay. Mm. Alright. Uh, so that relation improvement should be enough. Uh, influence nation, what? <laughs> influence nation of Albania? Wow. Okay, we became well advised. Wow, we have quite a lot of choice when it comes to our <laughs> advisors. Quite a lot indeed. Between all the bonuses that we get, we are getting good stuff. Okay, we are integrating Medina, which uh, hurts our di deeper reputation. I forgot about that. Uh, how long is that? I haven't checked. Um, ten years, all right, and high prestige for that. Uh, but we finished the mission. And we either want to conquer Sivas. Ah, that's the one here, yeah. Uh, I pass. I guess we'll just accumulate money. That's a free prestige, really. Mm. Oh, right. And we got some, some additional troops out of it. Now, uh, um, Okay, so this starts as a, as a territory, sadly. Uh, well, we want to make it into a state. Okay, we... Uh, we actually do have proper cores here. Yeah? Interesting way of going about it. How about this? Well, this is just bad. Okay, so this is a decent-ish province here. Okay. Now, if we were so inclined, could we start annexing a vassal? Uh, okay, they are not very pleased with us. Yeah, we kind of got to. Uh, okay, we could actually start annexing you. That would take a while and keep our diplomat busy, but I think this is the way to go. Uh, the reason why it would take a while is uh, we just lost two points of diplomatic... Uh, uh, what was it? Uh, two points of diplomatic... Uh, 
reputation. Yes, that was it. All right, so uh, this uh, let's allow this one to tick once more. Mm. If we were to annex, how long would it take? Uh, nine years. Okay. Mm. Before per month. Yeah, basically 100 months. Mm, well, eight, 8 years and a bit, uh, 8 and a half. Yeah, let's go for it. Mm. Okay, and uh, let's recall you. I guess we could also recall you because uh, so there isn't much to uh, get there. We need that to, for starting all those wars. I'm going to offer you an alliance. Uh, well, we'll have to wait a month between all the things, so uh, we are out of time. However, so we are going to get this vassalization and then go to wars against Aiden, which is allied with all of that, and Ada, which is uh, allied with basically the rest of this whole thing, and Ethiopia, which is, well, in the way. So <laughs> that should be interesting. And we do hope that uh, we are not gonna get attacked by. Uh, gee, is this considered a. No, it's not considered a car. Never mind then. Uh, so we do hope that it's not going to end up uh, bringing Ottomans against us. Thankfully, they are dealing with Knights in Ragusa, which may keep them occupied for, for a moment. Before I forget, though, let's uh, see. Uh, despite getting all those uh, territories here, we are yet to get uh, you know, a vassalization. Uh, that change, that difference uh, of economic base hasn't changed with Paramis, Paramanese. So um, uh, perhaps it's already counted our vassals. We'll see once we get uh, a few more. So thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.